I'm David Guller for uh, Irish Muscle and uh, I'm speaking with Orla Hopkins, the, the winner of fitness classes, uh, last fitness extravaganza. Uh, how are you, Orla? I'm great. Yeah, good, good. Uh, we are actually uh, taking a part of the general meeting of RABBF and uh, could you tell me what you're doing here? I'm sure you have a plan uh, and the reason why you're here. Okay, so basically um, this year I'm getting ready now in training for the Europeans in Santa Susana in May. Okay. So I'm here today just to find a bit more information and kind of what the next steps are the next couple of months towards the competition. Right, and I have to say I, I've seen your routine, uh, the fitness extravaganza. It was actually first time when I actually seen life, and uh, I really enjoy it. I have to say. Thank you. Uh, and unfortunately, we don't have this class, you know, right here. It was like years ago, uh, but you know, they they not hold it anymore. Um, it was. Did you have a chance to ask the guys about the maybe plan, you know, open again this class? You know. Yeah, we spoke about it here today actually and there seems to be you know, a bit of interest in it so hopefully um, they might have to maybe have hold it on maybe a female day or something like that because there's so many extra competitors that want to enter in different classes but I think this end of it really could be big I think like for girls and that are training hard and they don't want to get too big or else they're already ex-gymnasts or ex-dancers it's another way kind of for them to really keep in the training you know because you, you, st you still look like uh, very attractive you're still very fem it's very female yeah. and, right and uh, we, we see how the bikini growing up year by year but I'm sure it would be a lot of girls who would like to put something extra into it yeah, you know that's that would be gymnastic that would yeah. be kind of routine uh, I would like to ask you also about this uh, your uh, experience right as a fitness athlete before the fitness extravaganza did you ever have a chance to compete it how was that N not this not in this kind of I suppose categories is in like is in um, the IFBB or anything like oh, that right. I was an ex-gymnast so I trained and competed for the Irish squad um, for many years it's my teenage years yeah. um, stayed in kind of the fitness end of it as in you know just keeping fit yeah. but um, really wanted to get back on stage wanted to right. re-perform um, I'm also a dancer so to be able to combine all them as long mm. as well as kind of your weight training you know that's what just, I would like yeah. actually asking you what type of training are you doing are you are you working out as a usually fitness uh, girls or bikini like using weights you know and you're working out in the gym quite often three four five times a week how is that yeah I train um, Monday Tuesday Thursday Friday Sunday in the gym All right. um, and I, I would incorporate a lot more kind of I suppose um, of my kind of shoulder workouts using more my body weight mm. opposed to lifting weights okay. um, and then on Wednesdays I would do a full gymnastics training session so I go to my gym and I would train full out um, on Fridays I dance so I do four hours of dance on Fridays and then Saturdays I do choreography and body conditioning so I have to just add in a little bit extra than the other girls, but yep. I love it, so why not? As far as you enjoy it, it's, it's easy. Yeah. And uh, where are you working out, and is, do you have any personal trainer? Yeah, well, I train out of a gym, um, my local gym called Wellfit Gym, mm. and I'm, at the moment I'm um, under the guidance of Nicoletta, so she's helping right. me and yeah. coaching me, and um, nutri um, my nutrition is done by Drew Hennessy. He has done all my nutrition. Oh, and a very good team behind yeah. you. Yes, yeah, I'm lucky. Oh, well, so yeah. did you already start your prep for the European? I did, yeah. I started the first week of January. January. So um, straight back into it, and because um, for for this class, it's 50% routine and 50% body. So, but each competitor looks very different. It's not like bikini or you know body fitness. Each each kind of I suppose performer and athlete looks very different. So the body is quite important. But right. so I have to look my best. Yeah, that's a long prep. I think like over 20 weeks. Yes. Yeah. It's hard diet. How's it going so far? Yeah, it's it's uh, I've fallen off once, <laughs> but I got straight back on. And um, yeah, I'm not. I'm when I say it's it's clean eating. You know, it, it's tough, but I'm enjoying it. My real my real real prep starts next week, where it's real hardcore. Super strict. Listen, we wish you good luck. And Irish Muscle is behind you, and uh, we're gonna support you too. And uh, that was a pleasure to talk with you. Thanks very much. That was Irish Muscle, David Geller, and Orla Hopkins. Thank you. Thank you.